Imagine waking up one day to discover that everything you thought was real, your job, your relationships, your very identity, was actually an illusion, a construct created by your own mind, trapping you in a limited reality. Sounds like something out of a sci-fi movie, right? But what if I told you that this matrix isn't just fiction, but the very world we live in every day? And more importantly, what if you could break free from it and manifest the life of your dreams? This isn't just a fantasy. It's the groundbreaking work of Dr. Joe Dispenza, a neuroscientist and author who's been helping people around the world to literally change their reality through the power of thought. But before you dismiss this as some new age mumbo jumbo, let me ask you, have you ever noticed how some people seem to effortlessly attract success while others struggle no matter how hard they try? What if the difference isn't luck or circumstance, but something much more fundamental, the way they think? In this video, we're going to dive deep into Dr. Dispenza's revolutionary ideas and show you how to apply them in your own life. We'll explore the fascinating science behind how our thoughts shape our reality, from the quantum level all the way up to our day-to-day -day experiences. You'll learn powerful techniques to break free from limiting beliefs and step into a new, empowered version of yourself. Now, I know what you might be thinking. This sounds too good to be true. If it's so simple, why isn't everyone doing it? Well, that's exactly what we're going to address. We'll tackle the common roadblocks that keep people stuck in their old patterns and show you how to overcome them. By the end of this video, you'll have a clear roadmap for getting out of the matrix and manifesting the life you've always dreamed of. You'll understand why traditional goal setting often fails and how to tap into the unlimited potential of your mind to create lasting change. So, are you ready to take the red pill and see how deep the rabbit hole goes? To discover a world where your thoughts literally become things and where you have the power to shape your destiny. Buckle up, because we're about to embark on a mind-bending journey that could change your life forever. And who knows? The next success story we share might just be yours. Understanding the Matrix. Picture this. You're in a vast, dimly lit room filled with countless people, each staring intently at their own personal screen. On these screens, a dazzling array of images flicker. Dreams, fears, memories, and beliefs. But here's the kicker. None of it is real. It's all a projection. A complex tapestry of thoughts and emotions that we've mistaken for reality. This, my friends, is the matrix that Dr. Joe Dispenza talks about. But how did we end up here? Well, it all starts in childhood. As we grow, we absorb information from our environment like sponges. We learn to associate certain emotions with specific experiences, creating neural pathways in our brains. Over time, these pathways become so well-traveled that they turn into super highways of thought and behavior. Before we know it, we're running on autopilot, reacting to life based on our past experiences rather than consciously creating our future. Think about it. How many times have you found yourself in a situation reacting in a way that you later regretted? That's your subconscious mind at work, pulling the strings based on old programming. It's like having a super powerful computer that's running outdated software. No matter how much you try to change your life on the surface, that old programming keeps sabotaging your efforts. But here's where it gets really interesting. This matrix isn't just in our heads. According to quantum physics, our thoughts and beliefs actually interact with the world around us at a subatomic level. In other words, we're not just passively observing reality. We're actively creating it with every thought we think and every emotion we feel. So, if we're creating our reality, why does it often seem like life is happening to us rather than for us? That's the million dollar question and answering it is the key to breaking free from the matrix. But before we dive into how to do that, let's explore the fascinating science behind manifestation. Trust me, what you're about to learn will blow your mind and change the way you look at reality forever. The science behind manifestation. All right, 
let's put on our lab coats and dive into the mind-bending world of quantum physics. Don't worry, I promise to keep it fun and digestible. Imagine you're looking at your hand right now. Seems solid, right? Well, if you could zoom into the atomic level, you'd see that it's mostly empty space, with tiny particles zipping around. Zoom in even further to the quantum level, and things get really weird. At this scale, particles can be in multiple places at once, and they only settle into a definite state when observed. It's like they're playing a cosmic game of freeze tag with our consciousness. This is where Dr. Joe Dispenza's work gets really exciting. He proposes that our thoughts and emotions are not just chemical reactions in our brains, but quantum events that ripple out into the universe. Every time you have a thought or feeling, you're literally sending out a signal that interacts with this quantum field. But here's the kicker. This field doesn't distinguish between what's real and what's imagined. To your brain and the quantum field, vividly imagining winning the lottery creates the same neural pathways and energetic ripples as actually winning. This is why visualization is such a powerful tool for athletes and why worrying about something can sometimes seem to make it happen. Now, let's connect this back to our biology. When you have a thought, it triggers a cascade of neurochemical reactions in your body. Feel-good thoughts release dopamine and serotonin, while stressful thoughts flood your system with cortisol. Over time, we can become addicted to certain emotional states, unconsciously seeking out situations that will give us our familiar neurochemical fix. But here's the good news. Just as we can become addicted to negative emotional states, we can also rewire our brains for positivity and success. This is where Dr. Dispenza's techniques come in, helping us to break free from our old patterns and create new, empowering ones. As mind-blowing as this science is, it's just the tip of the iceberg. In our next section, we'll dive into Dr. Dispenza's key concepts and show you how to apply this knowledge to transform your life. Get ready, because things are about to get really practical and powerful. Dr. Dispenza's Key Concepts Now that we've laid the groundwork, let's dive into the heart of Dr. Joe Dispenza's teachings. Picture yourself as a master chef in the kitchen of your life. You've got all these ingredients, your thoughts, emotions, and actions. And Dr. Dispenza's concepts are the recipes that show you how to combine them to create the life you want. First up, let's talk about elevated emotions. We're not just talking about feeling happy here. We're talking about those powerful, expansive feelings like gratitude, awe, and unconditional love. These emotions aren't just nice to experience. They actually change your body's chemistry and energetic field. When you cultivate these elevated states, you're literally tuning yourself to a higher frequency, making you a magnet for positive experiences. But here's the catch. Most of us are stuck in a loop of recycling the same old emotions day after day. This brings us to Dr. Dispenza's next key concept, breaking the habit of being yourself. Sounds strange, right? But think about it. How much of your day is spent on autopilot, reacting to life based on past programming? To create real change, we need to interrupt these habitual patterns and consciously choose new ways of thinking and being. This is where meditation and visualization come in. Now, I know what you might be thinking. Meditation? Isn't that just sitting around doing nothing? Far from it. The kind of meditation Dr. Dispenza teaches is an active, powerful process of rewiring your brain and connecting with the quantum field. It's like a mental gym where you strengthen your ability to focus, elevate your emotions, and vividly imagine your desired future. Visualization is a crucial part of this process. Remember how we said the quantum field doesn't distinguish between what's real and what's vividly imagined. This is where you put that principle to work. By regularly visualizing your desired outcomes in rich emotional detail, you're literally programming your subconscious mind and sending out a powerful signal to the universe. Now, I can almost hear some of you skeptics out there. This all sounds great in theory, but does it really work? Well, 
That's exactly what we're going to explore next. We'll walk you through the step-by-step -step process of getting out of the matrix and show you how to apply these concepts in your daily life. Get ready, because you're about to learn how to become the architect of your own reality. Steps to get out of the matrix. All right, it's time to put on your metaphorical sunglasses and see the code of the matrix. Are you ready to take control of your reality? Let's break this down into actionable steps. Step one, recognize your limiting beliefs and patterns. Think of this as decluttering your mental space. We all have beliefs that no longer serve us, often picked up in childhood or from society. Maybe you believe money is the root of all evil or I'm not creative. These beliefs act like invisible barriers, keeping you trapped in old patterns. The first step is to become aware of them. Pay attention to your self-talk and recurring thoughts. What stories do you tell yourself about who you are and what you're capable of? Step two, design your new future self. This is where it gets fun. If you could be anyone, do anything, have anything, who would you be? Don't hold back. Write it down in vivid detail. How does this future you think, feel, and act? What does their average day look like? This isn't just daydreaming. You're actually creating a blueprint for your brain to follow. Step three, daily meditation and visualization practice. This is where the magic happens. Set aside time each day to sit quietly and focus your mind. Start by calming your body and elevating your emotions. Feel genuine gratitude, joy, or love. Then, vividly imagine yourself as your future self. Engage all your senses. What do you see, hear, feel, smell, and taste in this new reality? The more real you can make it, the more powerful the effect. Now, I know what some of you might be thinking. I don't have time for this or I can't sit still for that long. But here's the thing, even just 10, 15 minutes a day can make a huge difference. And like any skill, it gets easier with practice. Remember, you're not just daydreaming here. You're actively rewiring your brain and sending out a new signal to the quantum field. It's like updating the software of your personal matrix. But wait, there's more. In our next section, we'll dive into the nitty gritty of how to actually manifest your desires once you've laid this groundwork. We'll explore the fascinating concept of the quantum field and show you how to align your thoughts, feelings, and actions to become a powerful creator in your life. Are you excited? Because things are about to get really interesting. Manifesting your desires. All right, are you ready to become a manifestation maestro? Let's dive into the art and science of bringing your desires into reality. First, let's talk about the quantum field. Imagine a vast, invisible ocean of pure potential. This field contains every possible reality, just waiting to be observed into existence. Your job? To tune into the frequency of your desired reality and make it real. Here's where it gets really cool. Remember how we said that your thoughts and emotions send out a signal to this field? Well, this is where you put that knowledge to work. The key is to align your thoughts, feelings, and actions with your desired outcome. It's like tuning a radio to the exact frequency of the station you wanna hear. Start by getting crystal clear on what you want. Be specific, but focus on the essence of your desire rather than the exact form. For example, Instead of fixating on a specific job, focus on the feeling of doing fulfilling work that utilizes your talents. Next, generate the emotions you'd feel if you already had what you want. This is crucial. The quantum field responds more to your energetic state than to your words. If you're asking for abundance but feeling lack, guess which signal is stronger? Cultivate genuine feelings of gratitude, joy, and excitement as if your desire has already manifested. Now, here's where many people trip up. You need to act as if your desire is already your reality. This doesn't mean quitting your job because you've visualized winning the lottery. It means making decisions and taking actions that align with your vision. If you're manifesting a healthier body, 
Start treating yourself as if you're already healthy. Make food choices and engage in activities that a healthy person would. But here's the paradox. While you're doing all this, you need to let go of attachment to the outcome. I know, it sounds counterintuitive, but being overly attached creates resistance and doubt, which can block your manifestation. Trust that the universe knows the best way to bring your desire to you, and it might surprise you with something even better than what you imagined. Now, I can hear some of you saying, this all sounds great, but does it really work? Well, that's exactly what we're going to explore next. We'll share some incredible real-life success stories of people who've used these techniques to transform their lives in ways they never thought possible. Get ready to be inspired. Overcoming Challenges All right, let's get real for a moment. As powerful as these techniques are, the path to manifesting your dreams isn't always smooth sailing. There will be challenges, setbacks, and moments of doubt. But here's the secret. These obstacles aren't roadblocks. They're growth opportunities in disguise. One of the biggest challenges people face is impatience. We live in a world of instant gratification. And when our desires don't manifest overnight, it's easy to get discouraged. But remember, you're not just changing your circumstances. You're fundamentally altering your relationship with reality. This takes time. Think of it like planting a garden. You don't dig up the seeds every day to check if they're growing. You water them, provide sunlight, and trust in the process. Another common hurdle is the yeah, but syndrome. This is when your logical mind kicks in with all the reasons why your desires can't possibly come true. Yeah, but I'm not qualified enough. Yeah, but I'm too old and young, broke, and busy. These thoughts are just your old programming trying to keep you in your comfort zone. The key is to acknowledge these thoughts without buying into them. Thank your mind for trying to protect you, then gently redirect your focus back to your vision. Setbacks can also be challenging. Maybe you've been visualizing financial abundance, and then you get hit with an unexpected bill. Or you're manifesting perfect health, and you catch a nasty cold. In these moments, it's crucial to remember that manifestation isn't about controlling every detail of your life. It's about aligning with the essence of what you desire. These setbacks are often just the universe rearranging things to bring you what you want in an even better way. The key to overcoming all these challenges? Persistence. This isn't about gritting your teeth and forcing things to happen. It's about consistently returning to your practice especially when you don't feel like it. It's about choosing to focus on your vision even when your current reality seems to contradict it. Remember, every master was once a beginner. Dr. Joe Dispenza himself talks about how he struggled with meditation at first, but he kept at it and look at the impact he's had on the world. Your persistence is a powerful signal to the universe that you're serious about your desires. As we wrap up this journey, Let's take a moment to recap what we've learned and talk about how you can start applying these principles in your life right now. Are you ready to step fully into your power as a conscious creator? Let's do this. We've been on quite a journey together, haven't we? From understanding the matrix of our conditioned reality to exploring the mind-bending science of quantum physics, we've uncovered the incredible power that lies within each of us to shape our reality. We've learned that our thoughts and emotions are not just abstract concepts, but powerful forces that interact with the quantum field, literally shaping the world around us. We've discovered how to break free from limiting beliefs and step into a new, empowered version of ourselves through Dr. Joe Dispenza's revolutionary techniques. So, what's next? Well, that's up to you. You now have the tools to start rewriting the code of your personal matrix. Will you use them to manifest better health, more fulfilling relationships, greater financial abundance, or a deeper sense of purpose? The choice is yours. So, are you ready to step fully into your power as a conscious creator? To break free from the matrix and manifest the life of your dreams? The choice is yours, and the time is now. Don't wait for the perfect moment. This moment, right here, is your opportunity to begin. 
As Dr. Joe Dispenza often says, you are the placebo. You have the power to heal yourself, to change your life, and to impact the world around you. All it takes is your decision to start, your commitment to persist, and your willingness to believe in the incredible potential that lies within you. Thank you for joining me on this mind-bending journey. Remember, the matrix is just a construct, and you are the architect of your reality. So go forth, dream big, and create boldly. Your new life is waiting for you to step into it, and who knows, maybe the next success story we share will be yours. Until next time, keep manifesting, keep growing, and keep pushing the boundaries of what you believe is possible. The universe is waiting to dance with you. Are you ready to lead?